This is blowing my tiny mind. This is the future in my hands. I think my hair looks and feels really healthy. I didn't know I needed it, but apparently I do. <laughs> Beauty Lab at home where we've been busy testing the latest skincare, hair care and makeup so make sure you subscribe so you don't miss any episodes. This week we are testing in the T3 Curl ID which looks like this and apparently it's a smart curling iron. Interesting. The cool thing about this is that it has a smart ID function that literally customizes the heat to your hair. So you input your unique hair profile based on hair texture, color and chemical treatments for optimized heat and smooth shiny curls that last. This is blowing my tiny mind. This is the future in my hands. Oh, so it does have a manual mode so you can switch it over to manual temperature if you want to just input your own temperature. It's quite a thick barrel. If size matters to you, it's one and a quarter inches. So if you have shorter to mid-length hair like me, you're probably gonna get quite a short, bouncy look. It's 189 pounds, which is about standard for like those kind of good quality curling ones but we have obviously also tested ones that cost like 12 pounds and they've been really great so this is gonna need to wow my socks off okay so i finally figured out how to turn it on <laughs> it's harder than it looks because this is all touch sensitive you can lock it and then you basically have to input your hair type so you can do fine medium and then thick so i'm gonna do thick I'm gonna set my hair as medium. I'll go for fine. I've tapped it once to go for fine, just because my hair struggles to hold a curl. It says, have you had a color treatment? This is my natural hair color. I haven't had a color treatment. But then I am gonna select chemical treatment because I've had um, texture release on the ends of my hair. Okay, I don't select it because my hair's not chemically treated. So now I have to double tap the on button to lock in my heat profile locked in so now it's heating up it hasn't told me what temperature it's heating up to though but we'll see i guess here goes nothing so i'm not really used to curling my hair with one of these little clamps i can't remember how to use a cl oh, i can't remember how to use one of these <laughs> i'm sure that's not how you're supposed to do it but let's just see all right from the bottom and then wind up that's what you do isn't it I'm just gonna curl it away from the face Do you know what? I do think clamps just make it easier to style. Just holds it right in place. Let's release that. Let's have a look. Oh, that's perfect. That's a really nice curl. And then just release it. Very nice. Oh, wonderful. I don't know why I ever doubted you, T3. Feels really nice to hold it. Feels like this is almost like leather. I'm gonna try it as a wand as well. Oh, that's perfect. I just think the clip actually is so much easier. I miss, God, bring back clips. Such a nice curl. And the heat that it's selected, I don't know what heat it is, but it seems to have given a really nice curl to my hair. Also having a clip makes it so much easier to get those short bits of hair that just fall out normally. That's it. Right, final thoughts? <laughs> I love this curling tongue. Like, I didn't expect to, but I really do. I think it looks so nice. The wand itself, like, it is a little bit techy. I don't know if I'm the most tech savvy of people, so it did take me a few minutes to kind of get used to it and get kind of comfortable using the different um, settings. But I think once you do, it's actually really easy. It's kind of cool that it can, like, you can input your hair texture, your hair type, you can add all that information in and then it just kind of concocts this perfect temperature for you. Like I just think that's really cool and such a clever concept for tea free to come up with. So yeah, I'm quite impressed actually. I would definitely use this again. I really like the idea behind that, that it kind of just does what it needs to do based on the information that it, you tell it. I do think it needs to tell you the heat though, because that might be on like 210 and I had no idea. And I do understand that, yeah, my hair feels great, but I might not want to use that heat on my hair and that's my prerogative because it's my hair. Everything else I think is really great. And actually it's really made me remember how nice you can do your hair when you um, 
on here. And I think my hair looks and feels really healthy considering it's, and it's like day three, four between washes. So I'm really impressed. I am so impressed with that curler. It definitely took me a bit of a while. <laughs> Slight understatement. It definitely took me quite a bit of time to get used to it. You do need to read the instructions. You just can't avoid it. But I really like the clip. I know that's not part of their new technology, but I think I actually miss a clip in my life. And I just think the technology, I've never seen anything like this. I think it's really cool and innovative. And I just think it's gonna be less damage for your hair in the long run. So I am like super impressed by this. Full seal of approval there. Thank you so much for watching Beauty Lab at home. We'll see you in the next one.